Good afternoon vlog. Pick up my air. I pick up my parents from the airport later tonight and my mom wants me to go get them groceries. So I'm gonna go do that. And I'm going to wash my sheets because wash your sheets. Hey, I'm cleaning out this whole compartment in my bedside table. Hey, Bryn. What I was just looking upon were my cup stacking medals. 2009 WSSA Northwest Region Sports Stacking Championships, age division 10. Um, I got third place in the 363 and second place in the 363 relay, bitch. Yeah. So basically I'm a star or I was like 14 years ago. <laughs> that was 14 years ago. Anyway. I am right now regretting not taking a before picture because I um, just washed one of my Bagu bags for the first time because it was literally atrocious. You can see there's still like a little bit of like black stuff down here, but it was literally like this whole thing was like super dirty and like was black and like there was a little bit on the front and a bunch inside, but it cleaned it really well. Slay. from picking my parents up from the airport and we have a true sad moment because if you know me you know I kind of like getting cool lighters it's a recent thing and my parents got me a sick like flick up lighter in Hawaii and then TSA confiscated it <laughs> you'll be hearing from me dream that I had that was crazy. Jamie will get why it's so lit. Um, I was in like a room with Danny Gonzalez, Curtis Connor, and Drew Gooden. And me and Danny were like standing up and Drew and Curtis were like sitting on the couch and I was so high. I don't remember what I said though, but it felt like an accomplishment because I was just standing there and me and Danny were just goofing off. And then I said some dumb shit, and Danny fucking lost it. He was laughing so hard, and I felt so accomplished. And that's all I remember from the dream. Yeah, I was like,
It's trivia time, baby. Okay, you guys, our goal was to not get last place, and we didn't. We got second to last. Ooh. Okay, this is the debrief of the worst, most awkward encounter we just had inside of a Sub Zero. I have the, notes. They've all been bad. It was two guys working. They're like 16. Yes, they're like young. They bullied Shayna a lot about not getting a waffle cone with her ice cream. They were so mean! <laughs> I was uh, really when he thinking. came to put Shayna's ice cream in her cup, I think he was trying to be like sexy or something because he was like, oh boy. <sighs> Ew! I didn't even notice that! So I wrote, he said, oh boy, and groaned. Oh. Um, so that's the debrief because those guys were fucking for real. And they sang happy birthday to me. Yeah, Leslie said that it was Shayna's birthday and he started doing like an opera esque. Like, happy, happy, birthday. happy birthday. And I hated it happy so much. Happy birthday. That sound. That's I literally awful. had to walk over to the side because I was laughing so hard. Dude, it's gonna get. feeling sad. It's honestly pretty dry. That's my fault. <laughs> oh, but... So, review. Mm. Dry? Oh. <laughs> out of 10. Oh. <laughs> out of 10? Six and a half. Nice. Mainly because I put sriracha mayo on it. Mm. And that's always good. Yeah. Makes it better. Slay. Yeah. But, <laughs> cheers. <laughs> Going to a drag show, drag show, going to a drag show. We're on our way to Oregon to go to In N Out. <laughs> we are extreme. We're driving we three hours, three more this hours. This is Casey's the first time going to In N Out. It has to be a memorable experience. So we're making it one. Yes. No fucking way. <laughs> <laughs> 